if you see this one pattern on your chart, you better start to get ready and get that trade set up to know exactly where your entry, your target, and your stop loss is. Now, what is that one trade setup? Well, guess what? I'm going to tell you right now. But real quick, my name is Jason with Day Trading Fearless, and let's jump right into it. So that one trade setup is something on the chart that looks out of the ordinary. It's something on the chart that just captures your eye and makes you sit there and go, man, there's something about this that doesn't look right. Well, when we look at this chart, right here what is that level okay maybe pause it kind of go through and see let me know put in the comments what that candle is okay if you're able to see it because it's a couple things it stands out it's a potential reversal candle here's a hint right and it's maybe a precursor to a good trade setup that we could take so what is that trade it's this candle right here it is a hammer candle okay and with that hammer candle is we see price going lower right price is coming lower here's kind of a high right because you have our waterfall break to the upside and then fail and then we start to rally again but what happens right here we actually have a break of structure this candle could tell us hey that's a reversal candle meaning they sold it off brought it right back up the buyers did and then we moved higher from there and we kind of see the waterfall break to the upside reverse of trend and what happens is as that momentum carries higher we actually have a break of structure break of market structure right where it's the first high that we've made think about it right high lower high lower high lower high okay we kind of broke up here and then we failed broke here fail right and then this is a micro now we're not saying this is going to work 100% of the time, but is it a potential trade that we can lean against and manage our risk? Of course, because what we do is we see this trade right here, this candle. Guess what? Let's just kind of move time forward. Okay. And then what we could do is as price, we see the break of structure. If it pulls back into this area, we create a zone we can get long that trade where will our stop go right below the low of that candle because if we break below chances are it's going to keep on going lower and so what does price do it rallies right breaks and then it pulls back on that pullback we would have missed the trade by one tick it's okay to miss trades we will miss lots of trades but guess what we will never chase we are patient traders so guess what price kind of goes higher right never comes back down well if we zoom out of the chart is this level still active of course because we never really had a true test of that level right it came close but never had a true test so if price falls i would say hey this is a great entry for a quick scalp trade to the long side because i know i can manage my risk by just putting my order right below there it should not break below that level so if you think about it that is about 1.25 points on the es futures five ticks okay I would probably put my entry maybe right at the high of this candle and my stop would go one tick below set so that would give me 1.5 ticks sorry 1.5 points or six ticks worth of risk on the s p futures to get long and i would look for a one-to-one -one, uh scalp trade this would be what i call the smash and grab trade just get me in get me out so hopefully that helps hopefully you guys like this uh content and as always thank you for being a loyal subscriber make sure you guys let me know if you found that trade set up in this video and until next time we'll talk to you soon